Student, today we are going to learn why germanium and uh, silica is a semiconductor. Okay, so germanium, its uh, atomic number, mass number is uh, 32, silica mass number is uh, 14. Okay, what is the relation between those two elements? That is the discussion we are going to do. Okay, before learning to this, we should know what is the electronic configuration. Okay, then only we are able to learn why this two we are taken as a semiconductor. Okay, so electronic configuration, yes, P, D. F okay so it is a 1 2 3 uh, 4 and it is a 2 electron and it is a 6 electron and it is a 10 electron it is a 14 electron okay so yes yes first uh, line okay the second line p yes p yes electronic configuration third line you can write it's a reverse way it is a d p yes d p yes okay we are going to use only this until here okay anyway we will write f p uh, f d p s f d p s okay fourth line i am writing again f d p s okay always the reverse manner you should write okay it is for one it is two second s third s fourth s again fifth s sixth s okay uh, it is seven it is eight okay it is a number i am given okay second p you should start from two 2 is 3 it is 4 and it is 5 it is 6 and it is 7 okay d you should start from uh, it's a 3 3 and it is a 4 okay and it is a 5 and it is a 6 f you have to start from 4 okay 4 5 so it is a configuration number i given okay now we are going to see with the germanium germanium is a uh, uh, it is a 32 okay so atomic number will be uh, it is a mass number uh, atomic number will be 32 okay so first we have to write 1s 1s 2s okay 2p 3s 3p 4s okay 2p 3s 3p 4s number i wrote okay now we'll see the electron totally 32 electron is there s will be 2 okay p will be it is a 6 okay s yes, again 2 p is 6 s yes, again 2 okay totally so far 20 electron is over remaining we have 12 electrons okay i am taken third one 3d uh, 4p this also i am taken okay so it is 3d and 4p i am taken okay 3d it is a d will be the 10 electron and p will be the 6 electron but we have only remaining 2 electron 2 electron i wrote okay so this is a germanium electronic configuration okay p is required is a 10 electron okay but here only two electron is there that means the electron is not there it's enough electron is not there in this orbit okay that means so it is a, it's a lost band it is a conduction band have two electron okay before band it's a four it's a four it's a four s square is there okay here also two things is there conduction band and valency band okay so conduction band two electron it's a before band it's a four s square okay valency band also it's a two electron is a two plus two totally four electron it's having outermost orbit have four electron okay that is a germanium we'll see uh, it's a silica silica is a four 14 okay silica is a 14 okay so 1s and 2s 2p 3s and 3p so far i'm taken it is 2 it is 2 it is 6 it's 2 okay so totally 12 electron is over again remaining 2 only is there okay because totally 14 it's uh, there okay p is required 10 electron but here only 2 electron is there okay so the last band the conduction band have only 2 electron okay before band it's a valency band valency band also having 2 electron okay so totally 4 electron it is in outer state okay outermost orbit okay that means 4 electron in valency band uh, for, for 2 electron in valency band 2 electron in conduction band okay only germanium and silica have this combination okay what about the diagram see i am taken as a germanium it's same for silica also four outermost electron is there i am taken another germanium okay he, this also having four electron okay this side i am taken another germanium this also will be having another four electron okay this side i have another germanium it's also having four electron okay and this side i have germanium it's have four electron see germanium have four electron okay so 
four is for this germanium the another four is for uh, neighbor germanium okay so this made as a bond okay so it finally it became as a completed electron okay so the electron is completely filled there is no extra electron it's going to become as a insulator okay so when the heat is import okay when the energy is given the bond will be break lot of free electron will be create okay that is a thing it's going to act as a semiconductor okay so that is a reason germanium and uh, silica we are taken as a semiconductor it's a pure form of semiconductor because outermost electron we have four electrons thank you